What can destroy large buildings and let 20 ton railroad cars from their tracks? It's a tornado. Ever wonder how tornadoes form? Well, I'm going to tell you. First, layers of strong winds in a storm blow at different speeds and directions. In between these layers, a column of air starts spinning on its side like a rolling log. Then upward winds lift one end of the spinning column. Downward winds push down on the other end. This spinning column of air is called a funnel cloud. It is a tornado if it touches the ground. Tornadoes can last a few minutes, but they can leave a path many kilometers wide. You might see a tornado as a giant dirt cloud. Well, you're wrong. Actually, it's a rotating funnel-shaped cloud. Ever think of looking up the definition of tornado? Well, you're too late, because I already have it. It's a whirling, violent storm. Like a hurricane, it has a rotating funnel shape. Done? Mm -hmm. What's the parent of the tornado? It's the thunderstorm. Have you ever had a thunderstorm in your town and wonder what caused this? Well, I'm going to tell you. First, they have to form it form a cloud, which involves moisture. To form, clouds and rain are needed. Then there's unstable air, relatively warm air, that can rise rapidly. Then lifts. Sea breezes, mountains, and, and hills are capable of lifting air to help form thunderstorms. Let me guess. You think thunderstorms are gray clouds that water comes out of. Well, you're wrong. Actually, it's when the atmosphere becomes unstable enough to form large, powerful updrafts and downdrafts. Then a towering thundercloud is built up. Is built up. Some people think a, sun, a thunderstorm is just a storm. Well, it's not. It's a it's a storm with thunder, lightning, and rain. Thunderstorms are like hurricanes and tornadoes because they all need air and clouds to form. Lightning can kill lots. Lightning can kill people, and here's what happens. Lightning is caused by ice particles in the cloud colliding. When bigger particles collide against smaller particles, it causes it. Lightning is made. It heats up the air and makes sound and makes waves that were the lightning sound. Most what happens between June 1st and November 30th? It's a hurricane. Have you ever seen a hurricane on TV and wonder how it happened? Well, I'm going to tell you. Hurricanes get their energy from warm ocean water. When the water vapor from the ocean condenses, it releases energy. Under the right conditions, under the right conditions, this energy builds and drives the winds of the hurricane. Once it's over land, the hurricane's energy is reduced. You probably think a hurricane is a scary thing that kills people. Well, you're kind of right. It's actually a severe tropical cyclone with the wind exceeding 75 miles per hour and usually producing heavy rain. A hurricane is like a tornado because they both have winds exceeding 75 miles per hour.